Welcome back to my channel, guys. We are into month number five of our analytics report, my analytics report. Oh, I'm tangled up. What the f Was that tag sticking out the entire time? Too bad. I'm not refilming it. I'm not. <sighs> wow. We are into month number five already. Time is flying by. Welcome back to my channel, guys. My name is Linda Lee. If you guys are just tuning into this video for the first time, I used to make YouTube videos eight years ago. I stopped doing them, now I'm returning and I'm tracking my progress through with my journey to monetization. So that is what you are watching with this video now. What I'm gonna go over for this month, as usual, is my analytics for the past month and that'll be from March 4th to February 3rd. That didn't make sense. I'm gonna be going from February 4th to March 3rd. That was reversed. I'll go over what I learned for the past month and what I still need to learn, any equipment or gear that I've had to purchase, what I need to do for next month, and then any exciting or just memorable moments. Memorable moments. Hopefully we're all good now. <laughs> So we'll just go straight into this. So views for the past month, 2,882. That is a decrease from the last month. The total for watch hours, I got 185.2. Again, another decrease. I only gained 23 subscribers, which is about a 30% drop from the previous month. But hello, welcome to anyone who's new. Welcome to my channel. The most subscribers that I have gained in a day this past month was three in a day. And there was about two days like that. But there was a period of three days where I actually lost one subscriber per day. Um, and that kind of sucked in the moment, but like, that's life. You know what I mean? YouTube is such a vast place that I'm not gonna be everyone's cup of tea and that's okay. I like me. I only uploaded three videos in the past month. I did not upload a video last week. I was in the middle of my midterms and there was a lot going on. If you guys don't know, I'm also currently a nurse in Canada, but I'm upgrading to get my Bachelor of Science in Nursing. School is always first for me. It is always um, a priority for me. That's just what it is. <laughs> Best performing video, I'm not gonna get into like the video specific, but I will just say that videos in general that seem to perform well on my channel are tech related and I'll link a card above that just has a playlist of all the tech videos. There's a mixture of Apple products, um, unboxing reviews, and then the Sony ZV-1 camera and some stuff about that. The ICTR, which I'm aware some people just refer to it as CTR, but it is the impressions click-through rate. Some people just say click-through rate, but on the YouTube studio, it actually does say impressions click-through rate. Anyway, so I am at 6.1%, which is actually an increase from the last two months. So that's that's good news. That's really good. And if I go into the main traffic source, YouTube still remains to be the number one traffic source at about 39.1%, which is an increase from last month as well. And a large portion of my external traffic is coming from Google searches directly or Instagram. And then into demographics. And it is showing actually my return viewers compared to new viewers. And obviously right now, just because I'm a new channel, there's more new viewers coming in than return viewers. And that's okay, that'll change with time. Most of my views are still coming from the States with Canada right, not right behind, not, not right behind by any means. And the UK is pretty much on par with Canada. The age demographic is still continuing to change. And I noted this in my last analytics report. In the first couple months, I was only seeing viewers age 25 to 34. And I'm slowly starting to see a new age group of 18 to 24 and that has continue to increase this past month. And it still remains to be that most of my viewers identify as female. The average view duration is at three minutes and 51 seconds, about consistent from the last couple months. Um, revenue is still zero. <laughs> channel's not monetized. That's what these videos are about. I say that in all of these videos. So until the channel's monetized, I will, the revenue is just going to continue to be zero. And I'm just going to keep telling you that it's zero. The grow with YouTube in total as of yesterday, I have 705 subscribers and 802 public watch hours, which I think is pretty cool. Jumping into what I've learned in the past month and then still need to learn. So the first thing I learned is how to use hashtags under the title of the video, or I guess it's just above the title of the video. Hashtags I think has helped out with my video views a little bit. There's certain guidelines with YouTube that they they prefer with the hashtag. So I can talk about that more in another video if that's something that interests you guys. The other thing that I have learned, the 
the Amazon affiliate links. I've had a couple people click in. No one has purchased anything, okay? Like I have not made any money on Amazon affiliate links. I think majority of this has to do with the links that I'm posting are on the Canadian Amazon store. I haven't quite figured out how to link things on the American Amazon because majority of my viewers are from the States. So it would make more sense if people are clicking on and are able to purchase things from the American Amazon. I did get a notification um, email from Amazon a couple weeks back, just basically saying that you need to have a minimum of three sales um, in your Amazon affiliates account before they close your account off. And that's, I think they said within at least 180 days. So I've already reached my halfway mark with that. I think I probably only have 60 days left at this point and then the account will be closed off, which kind of sucks, but I don't know, <laughs> I'll have to figure something out. The other thing that I have learned is how to animate more videos using Canva. Now I talked about Canva again in my last video and Canva has been a great tool to use. If you guys don't know, I am editing on iMovie. It's a very basic software. There's only so much that you can do with it. So I'm trying to figure out different ways to like make my videos look nice and more entertaining without dishing out a bunch of cash onto a software and trying to relearn an entire software right now. The other interesting thing that I have learned as well is about social blade and it's not that I've learned about social blade for the first time but I looked in to my own name on social blade I'm gonna come out with a video about that soon just about different things that I've learned to do with social blade so stay tuned for that but there's a couple interesting analytics in there number four is any equipment or gear that I've had to purchase for this channel but I bought two things so the first thing that I bought was just a very simple camera case for the Sony ZV-1 it's um a neoprene material just Velcro. There's a little spot inside for a battery pack and then a zipper in the front for extra memory cards if you want. I'll link that below if you feel like checking it out and want a camera case. And then the other thing that I purchased was something that was desperately needed and that is extra batteries. Extra batteries. Read all about it. Extra, extra. So my camera kept dying because the battery that comes with the Sony ZV-1 I think sucks. So I did go on Amazon and I purchased a set of three batteries that came with a charger so you can charge all three at the same time. I have loved being able to continuously film things and just being able to swap out batteries, take an extra battery with me as opposed to solely relying on the battery that comes with the camera. I will link those in the description below as well. I do think this battery also works with a bunch of other cameras as well. So check that in the link of the description on Amazon. Number is just what I want to continue doing going forward for next month and it's just time management honestly I've realized especially even with nursing school half the battle and I definitely realize this a little later than I should have but half the battle is definitely just getting organized as long as I have a plan and just actually execute the plan then I've already kind of laid out uh, foundation for myself but half the battle is definitely just organizing things and organizing my week and of course things come up life happens but you do your best to roll with the punches and just just get things done so I'm just going to continue working on time management and that's not anything new because I've mentioned that in all of these videos and then the last thing is just exciting things to remember and I have three things for this first thing is that earlier in the month I had the same number of subscribers and watch hours at the same time so I took a screenshot of that how often is that ever going to happen again it's not the second thing that is I don't want to say exciting to remember but definitely memorable is I got my first angry not happy comment comment and it was a video that I posted about the Dr. Mike situation. This person clearly didn't watch my video all the way through. They clearly didn't grasp what I was saying in the video I and mean, it was kind of to me it just seemed like a troll comment but I gently commented back and uh, I said everyone was entitled to their opinions and that was cool. So you know not everyone's gonna like you. Not everyone's gonna agree with you. Not everyone's gonna watch your videos completely to the end and I'm aware of that. I accept that. I'm cool with that. So you know you do you and then to end this completely off on a good note is I have reached just over 700 subscribers and that is something that is super exciting to me so again welcome to my channel again everyone new that has subscribed if you haven't subscribed click the subscribe button below join the team watch the journey um, learn things every day like I am and you know stuff i post things about nursing lifestyle finance and tech so there's about four things there it's a work in progress so click to see the progress and um i would love to have you join the team family group learning 
group. I don't know what this is. Anyways, that is it for this video. This is month number five, journey to monetization. I am very excited of the progress that I am making. Stay tuned for more videos and I will see you guys in the next one.